Now, former South African President Jacob Zuma has been found guilty of being in contempt of court. He's sentenced to 15 months in prison. Anga Kapola has the story from Johannesburg. The country's highest court, the Constitutional Court, in fact, found that Zuma was guilty of contempt for defying court orders to testify before the Zondo Commission of Inquiry into state corruption during Zuma's nine years in power. The commission, in fact, approached the, commission, uh, the court several months ago and asked for an urgent ruling to be made about the behavior of the ex-president. The court responded with Tuesday's 72 majority verdict with its 15-month sentence. In a scathing uh, judgment, Judge Sisi Kampepe said that while Zuma was no ordinary litigant, no person enjoys immunity from the law. The court said it's disturbing that the ex-president had in fact undermined and attempted to destroy the rule of law. Reaction to the judgment has been widespread and Zuma's family has also rallied around the president, or the former president should I say, with his son Edward warning authorities that they would have to kill him first before the president actually went to jail. Spokesperson for Zuma said it was strange that the court had actually sentenced Zuma without a, cr a criminal court case. Meanwhile, Zuma has been given five days to hand himself in to police, and if that deadline passed, the South African police minister had three more days to make or to take Zuma into custody. Experts do suggest that Zuma would likely serve just a few months of his sentence before being paroled. I'm Angelo Coppola for CGTN in Johannesburg, South Africa.